What's up guys, Reboot here. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use name drop. First, you want to make sure you've already set up your contact poster. So if you haven't already, make sure you go ahead and do that first. I'll link a video in the description and there should be a card popping up that will take you to that video to show you how to set up your contact poster if you don't know how. So I'll go ahead and hit that pause button, watch the contact poster video, and I'll wait for you here. Okay, you're back. Now let's put that new contact poster to work using name drop. So to use name drop, first you want to go ahead and head over into the phone app, then tap on contact. Once you're here, you want to go ahead and tap on my card, then tap on the contact photo and poster. From here, you want to make sure to enable the name and photo sharing option. And once that's enabled, you can select from either contacts only, which will automatically share and up to your name, photo and poster with people in your contacts. Or if you set to always ask, then you will be asked before your information is shared. Once you select either option, then you're ready to use name drop. So to share your new contact poster, go and find a new friend, put your phones next to each other, and you will see the cool new animation. Then your contact poster will show up first on your device, and you will be asked if you want to share your contact info or if you only want to receive the other person's contact info. So just select the option that's best for you. In this case, I will select share on both devices, and then each one will receive the new contact information. And yeah, that's how you use name drop. If you guys have any other questions about any new features on iOS 17, make sure to comment down below, and don't forget to hit that thumbs up if this video helped you out. Thanks for watching.